not this one, not this one. Wait, what? There's it, another he one. He hung. There's right more? Here. Where? Where is he? Look. Oh, he's right. Oh! Oh! Oh, 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 Look at this dragon. So we're gonna see if there are any iguanas in these trees. And we're gonna see if, there you go, we can make any of them fall out and be frozen. Under 50 degrees Fahrenheit, iguanas go in a dormant state. Since they're great climbers, they can have themselves perfectly balanced up in the trees. Sometimes they just need a little shake. Okay. I'm gonna pop my collar real quick. All right, y'all. It's a frozen iguana advisory here in Florida. We're gonna see if we can get them blown out of the tree. Keep in mind, fallen frozen iguanas can be hazardous. Especially if they hit you, they could result in injury. Oh, woo, that boy is yeah. Oh my goodness. He is super cold. Like he got ice on his lips. That's a female. That right there, my friends, is a frozen iguana. Let's take a look at this bad girl real quick. Stiff as a board. Eyes are closed right there. It's it's. I can feel it slowly reacting, but as you can see, it's in a lifeless state. But you can see it's moving. So I believe it is alive, but it is. Look, it just fell out. That's all it can do. That's all it can do. Just my nerves. Just yeah. It's just it's trying to move, but it can't because it's frozen. Guys, these iguanas are cold blooded. Once their body temperature goes beneath 50 degrees, that is the state of frozenness that they go into. It's a defense mechanism. It keeps them alive. Yeah, but it can also kill them. Let's check some more trees, gents. Big light over here, please. An interesting ability that most reptiles have is the ability to go in a cryogenic state. This slows down their metabolism and allows the body to keep the brain, heart, and other vitals alive. Normal bodily functions will be restored once the correct operating temperature has been satisfied. Oh. <laughs> Naturally, about 20% of the frozen falling iguanas will be dead. Some of them will just not be able to recover after going that cold for that long. I believe I can fly. I don't know actually if they're dead or not. Freezing out here, and there's ticks going around. Do you think the ticks on the iguanas die as well? Put them right here next to his buddy. Come on, sweetheart. There she is. There she is. All right, all right. He fell out the tree. Oh. oh, shoot. Oh. Whoa. Oh, it's Whoa. right there. There's Where? a baby right there. Oh, he fell. A baby fell. No, not this one. Not this one. Wait, what? There's it, another one. He hung. There's right more? Here. Where? Where is he? Look. Oh, he's right there. Oh. Oh, my God. It's raining. It's raining. The iguana oh, rain has a tear. Dude, this is insane, bro. They're frozen for real. Oh, look. There's a tick. Did he oh, die? Is he dead? Yep, frozen solid. Mm. Check this out, full of protein. Oh. <laughs> Just kidding, we threw him in the water. <laughs> Dude, wait, I think there's another one. In my opinion, I believe about 70% of the entire population is smart enough to go underground. The other 30%, well, those are your alphas, those are your juvies, those are your young bucks, those are your naive iguanas. They're the ones that go up in the tree and not knowing the devastating effects it could potentially have on them. Be safe, iguana. Another female. A female Gemini, and that's going to be an alpha female? Oh, 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 I just heard something. I just heard something. Oh, oh, oh. Gotta be go? careful when you're walking in Florida, especially by lakes and canals. Oh. So much erosion caused by iguanas. Right by the water. We don't want to go. Oh, oh. <laughs> you alright? Yeah. Silly iguanas. Another female. Yeah, one more. Where? Right above you. 
You want to shake her down? What do you see? We're still looking for an alpha, dude. We know there's an alpha. And then the Iguana Ninja spotted something. Oh, shoot. He might be frozen. I think he's frozen too. Oh, wow. He's trying to bite though. He is Pink. frozen, guys. That, my friend, is a Cuban night no. Another invasive venom? species. No, no, this no. one loves to eat wow. insects like and no, other like smaller venom. animals. If that was venomous, I'd have not picked that up. Let's put him on the ground and see how frozen he actually is. You know his, <laughs> you know his iguanas are frozen. Let's put him down. Well, he's less frozen than the iguanas, but he's still pretty cold. These, some of these iguanas might be dead. I don't even see them breathing, dude. Wow, this is a weird anomaly right here, y'all. Matter of fact, y'all stay here. Let me go get my thermometer thing on my bobber. Uh -huh. We're gonna check some temperatures and then we're gonna uh, continue the hunt for a big fat alpha. Big fat alpha. All right. Let's get it, y'all. Yeah. Nope, another one came. Almost knocked the ninja out. <laughs> they just keep popping out, y'all. The silly frozen iguanas. All right, we came back, got our thermometer. Check the temperature. Ooh, 37, 39. They're about 30, 38 degrees. 37, 39. That's cold, boys. That's cold. Freezing is, is 32 or 33, I think. So they're dang near about frozen. That right for real, for real. Let's check this guy. He's 49. He's a little bit warmer. He was kind of like not as high up. Yeah, now he's a he's a wolf. He's a little bit more coherent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you guys see the temperature right there. They are in the 30s. Yeah. EJ, what do you see, bro? You see an alpha male and probably his breed and female that he was with. And they probably got, mm. and they frozen together. Wow. And we was just out here looking for that alpha male, but not his breed and female. Frozen together in time, y'all. We're going to see if we can bring them boys down. Boys and boys down. Let's right. make it rain frozen, Iguana. Oh. Yep. Okay, cool. Oh, there we go. You might have to give a two hand shake, bro. Boom! Oh, shoot. That wow. just happened. Female up there? Yeah, his female. He's still up here. Ooh. There's the female. He's out cold. He's out. And, <laughs> and not to worry, guys, when iguanas fall, they actually have something in their body, their body like a suspension that they can absorb like impact from falling. They do it all the time in trees. So he's out cold. He might, there's like, no, nah. look at that. There's, he's just limp. Look, you see that? Yeah. Oh man, he might be dead. He might, he might have froze to death. Yeah. Look, he's blue at the bottom. Yeah, he is blue. Wow. Yeah, he is. She knows she's still a the little female, The female is still coherent kind of. Yeah. She knocked him out cold. Yeah, you can tell the difference. This one actually feels dead. This one feels like it has life. He feels like there's no life in him. There's no life in him. Let's see something. Wow. The aftermath, y'all. Check it out. Sheesh. They're frozen in time right now. All right, guys. Let's put this in the pile real quick, and then let's go see if we can find big bad alphas. Let's put them in the pile. Those silly frozen iguanas. There we go. Right, oh, look at that giant. What? <laughs> oh, shoot. What the heck? You didn't. Yo, what the fuck? Uh, uh, I knew there was an alpha. Ninja. Yeah. What do you think we should do in this situation, bro? Grab uh, I'll grab him. You sure? Yeah. Are you going to put a cubby jump? Here, here, here. Let me see something. Guys, look at this right here. Pure frozen. It's like he tried to make it up the tree, but it was too late. It was too late. He just couldn't do it anymore. Yeah, Got frozen it. in time. You want to do the honors, Ninja? Yeah, I say we just pull him down see what happens. Yeah. Easy. See if he's dead. See if he's alive. See if he's frozen. Oh, wow. He looks stiff. Piece of ice. Oh, my God. 
There it is, people. Wow. Look at this dragon. Hold him up, ninja. Big frozen iguana right here. Damn, look at the mohawk on that thing. It's frozen. It's frozen solid. He's asleep. It's full of parasites. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. And he's, in, he's intact. Not too many scars. Doesn't look. Look at these talents on this guy. Jesus. Look at the claws. Dinosaur like. Oh, yeah. To say the least. Yeah, he's frozen, frozen. Are we seeing any kind of. I mean, he's, he's opening his eyes, closing it, but it's all slowly. All his movements are fast. He looks like he's trying to curl up into a ball. Now he's reaching out for help. Let's, uh, let's, 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 uh, check his temp. Yeah. See what he's working with. You guys see, we're just trying to get as much data as possible and, and information for you guys. So you guys just can see it. Cause I know a lot of people see it on the news and la la la. And we're out here right now. So we want to kind of show you, let's see what he's reading at real quick. He's at, oh man, he's at 40. Yeah. He's at 41, dude. He's ice dumb cold right now. Yeah. He's freaking. He's frozen. All right, we're gonna bag this guy. Bag him and tackle. He's frozen. As the night goes on, the weather gets colder. Eventually, some of these frozen hanging iguanas will fall, especially if it's windy. Luckily for the iguanas, the wind was very mild. I just wanna show you how, how, how frozen this guy is. Go ahead, Ninja, just like put him on his back real quick. Like he's stiff as a rock. Look at him, he's petrified. He's probably do a handstand. He's petrified. Look at that. If this guy wasn't frozen, he would be a force to be reckoned with. But since he's in this state of, I guess. Frozenness? Yeah. You could just examine him more. Oh, now he's trying to wake up a little bit. Look, you can even, his saliva is even. Frozen. Frozen. He's got frost in his mouth. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. That looks. He's got ice. Bigger looks, iguanas really, have a high it, chance it of dying like if they fall. Reason being is they're so big and heavy, a high hard fall can kill them. Smaller iguanas have a higher chance of frostbite. All right, let's go. Let's go check out the pile, y'all. We'll call it a night. All right, y'all. Hey, we're going to wrap it up right here. Ninja, you want to get us a count, bud? Oh, yeah. So we got one frozen iguana. Two frozen iguanas. Three frozen iguanas, four frozen iguanas, five, six, seven, a eight, a nine, and a ten, and eleven, baby. Oh, you forgot one more. Frozen. Popsicle. Thirteen. What did I say? Eleven? Twelve. Twelve. Twelve piece. Twelve piece plus a giant biscuit. Big biscuit right here. He's frozen. Like he's frozen. Look at this. He's frozen. So guys, we follow all the FWC guidelines. Unfortunately, iguanas are invasive species in the state. So frozen or not, it will be euthanized. But don't worry because these are some really, really good food. It's a lot of tasty meat, so none of it will be going to waste. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, comment, hit the red subscribe button if you're new. Oh, we were at 241 okay. and that and plus 12 that is 241 plus 12 you're in school what's that that's a lot 241 plus 12 is 253 253 yeah we're at 253 iguanas yeah for the year let's put these in the bag on to the next oh yeah